write a tribute down but I will I will just tell you what my dad was to me and to my sister. So I Mueko was a great man as we all know. He loved everybody and he loved us very much and um, the people who have followed me on my TikTok know we are very close, very, very close. And I can say a lot of men do like marry afterwards, after their wives die and their kids are left in the mercy of their stepmom and all. But my dad wasn't like that. He stayed with us, he comforted us, he was there for us. And he gave us everything we needed. So today I can just say he was the best man I can describe. And we love him so much. Yeah, that's all I can say. Thank you. Good morning, Yosho. Praise God. I am Moriko. Ni guru ama tribute ya mwagi Na guru ama nagi gogo Kwa wakitu kanagi nagi kweo So this is mwagi's tribute To his father Dev is a part of life and once it strikes someone you so dearly love, your existence will never be the same. Dad has rested, and I know the pain of losing my dad will perhaps never leave me, and especially losing him in my arms. I imagine it will ease with time as I process and get through it, but I don't think I will get over it. How can I, how can you get over a person who has been there since? Uh, who has been there since you even knew yourself, since you are even aware of yourself. His death is painful, especially since it has closely followed moms. Dad was so many things to me and to us as the family. Number one, he was a loving father. He would go to any length to ensure we were taken care of, even when situations were hard because they have been. His love for me and my family was unmatched. He had a special bond with my son, Miles. Miles was the only one who had the rights to stand on his glass table. He taught him to ride the bike, and Dad also visited us when my daughter was born with a gift that I will forever cherish. Dad was also uh, our discipline master. Ile Vita Nileono Maze, as the only son, and being the firstborn, <coughs> I always took the fall even when I was innocent. He would later tell me he was doing this to instill responsibility and a discipline in me and to ensure I would take care of my sisters and my family. I did not know it would be too soon. Dad was also the no-nonsense person. He loved facts, was very strict. Actually, three months ago, I had a small misunderstanding with my sister who I thought was inciting Dad against me. Dad called me and told me, son, when there is an issue to solve, don't beat around the bush, just come to me straight. We were able to resolve the misunderstanding amicably, and he will never take sides. He treated us, all of us, equally. Dad was an artist and a comedian. He was multi-talented. He would have easily become an actor as well as a musician. And if you have watched his music videos, you would be forgiven to imagine him as a comedian. Someone may even think he would bring his... Uh, at home. In his uh, acting voice, he was also very kind. He welcomed all my friends and made them feel part of the family. I was, our home was open to my workmates, church colleagues, 
Psych family, everyone was welcome. His celebrity status notwithstanding. He has attended my, in, my friend's invites, events courtesy of my invite and for free. And as good, I am one of the beneficiaries. He was also very supportive. He always had my back. I could talk to him about anything and he would always listen and offer solutions. He never shut his door on me, not even once. I will truly miss his reassuring support. His life, his influence, his energy is linked to mine and now take comfort that in that in knowing that my dad will never be in pain. Thus, that this world suffering is no longer something he has to endure. My dad, Muheko, will forever be in my heart until the day it stops beating. And I am grateful that I am becoming a more fully realized human being, a more caring, compassionate, and empathetic person because of my dad. Still, I would forfeit any wisdom for the sake of having him back. Now, I can only promise you one thing, dad, that the dreams you had of us as a family a successful and life for me and my sisters will happen. I will push through the wire to ensure your vision is a reality. It is sad that our time together in this earth has been so short and I have to let you rest in peace. Say hello to mom in heaven when you meet her. I know she has been waiting for you. Till we meet again, dad, bye bye. I will forever love you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
Nikana niyo kikima immediately. Mwini tu uto kame ni ati. Ni adie nukuru. Adu yale oza mea woko na aini. Ale oza mala edete mwiko. Leka ito nyi itane mwoko wo mwodi. Jei buru. Mwudu wiko kero wa wo jei. To tike nene ne tuwa gomidia. Kai yetu gaka gaki. Nanga yi mizoni yako mwadima. Ni mwoko wano kwa liwega. Na kikuru kwa liwega vila guri. Na kiti yoke na ya nudu yale mea woko wano kama ina iguru. Tuko mta ito shito na ihenya. Na wale ya mali online. Ona wale toko heo na bani kita tome kerele hau. To gomidia banis. Ma wato ma shoma ke maa nyoba. To tana uma woko. Ne toko mwome nidia. Ori ya toko weka. Yada tu heo na apana ihenya. Eri ya toko wekea. Iguida ni heo nireko. 0716. Ni ya nani? Ya mwas. Good. Producer wa kwa jimi. Ekira na beho. 0716. Sorry. 